So we're going to have a little look at why sometimes the monitoring shows up figures that people think uh, are, look a bit strange. Let's put it that way. So battery storage is all about cause and effect. Okay, so the way any system is installed, um, there is a grid CT which goes around where the power comes into your property. Okay, and that's how we get these readings here. Okay, um, a solar inverter is constantly matching uh, solar to the grid supply to make sure that we've got fluid AC. Um, the actual uh, monitoring that we're looking at here, this monitoring takes a snapshot of the data in the Lux unit and then it refreshes it every five minutes. So whatever it sees stays there until it takes the next picture five minutes later. Okay, And a Lux unit will always update itself around every two to five seconds, something like that. So occasionally you can look at the monitor and think, hang on a minute, that doesn't look right. It seems to be exporting. I'm sure if you look at the numbers, it should be charging or whatever. What you will find is that all that has happened is this. When it takes that particular snapshot, the data that comes in from the CT clamp is shown because it's in milliseconds. A Lux unit reacts every two to five seconds and the monitoring is every five minutes. So it's just a question of cause and effect. It's just taken that picture at a time where probably a load has increased in the house or the solar's dramatically changed from one level to another. It is possible to find it in the background and have a look at that. But that is why 99 times out of 100, if you either wait for the monitoring to refresh itself or you can actually click this little button here to accelerate trying to, cap to, trying to, trying to get it to upload, it doesn't always work, but it will do if it can, then suddenly it'll move on and you go, okay, there we go, that's what it is. It is cause and effect. Something has to happen, i.e. a load change or something has to adjust for the system to be able to react. So you have to allow it that time to react. But the monitoring only takes a picture every five minutes. So that is 99 times out of 100 why sometimes the monitoring will say something and then as it, as it refreshes, it goes back to normal and you go, okay, yeah, that's all good. Okay. If you do have an issue, though, what we would need is we would need a screenshot of the page uh, so that we can see what it is that you, do, you think does not look correct. And we will need the time down here and the date that this screenshot was taken. We can then identify exactly where all that data came from. And 99 times out of 100, we will show you there was a big change in the load in the house or the solar change or something like that. That's the explanation of cause and effect and that's why sometimes the monitoring looks a little bit abnormal. Just wait and refresh it. Thank you.